Many tourists come to Drepung Monastery, but only few of tourists might have done a Drepung Kora. But Drepung Kora, it is really, really interesting things to be done. So that's why today I'm going to lead you to do Drepung Kora to see an authentic view of the monastery and as well as Lhasa city. Let's go. So Buddhism isn't really, really important in Tibet. As well as you can see here, even nature helps us to pray because you don't need people to rotate these prayer wheels. It was done by water, so water rotate the prayer wheels. You can see one of the highlights during the way to Akora. You can see one of the oldest buildings in Drepung Monastery that have history about 600 years, more or less. On the way to uh, Drepung Kora, you can also enjoy those big rock paintings. And in the central, you can see the High Lama that is called Tsongkhaba. And he is the founder of Gelugpa sect. And in his time, he have like thousands and thousands of disciples under him. But there, you can see two main disciples of Tsongkhaba, which is called Gelsabje and Kiltrupje. Right behind the central, you can see the image of Garuda. And you can also see lots and lots of mantras that has been carved onto the rocks. On the way to Kora of Trepung Monastery, you also can see, even in nature, lots and lots of offering the water in the bowls. And this is one of the daily uh, activities for a Tibetan Buddhist people. So even in nature, you can offer things to Buddha. So this is how we believe in Buddhism in Tibet. Here I found a perfect place to burn a juniper. So, 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 pull us a jealous and yellow. So, 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 so. At the moment, I'm at the highest spot of the Drepung Kora. And from here, you can enjoy the view of Lhasa, the no new modern city, as well as you can see the river, the Lhasa River.
on the highest spot of Dragon Kora, as well as you can see here, and small chapel, which also you can see the statue of Green Tara inside that chapel. my god what an awesome day like i've done nearly about three kilometers that rep on cora and i've seen so many different things at that cora and i've seen like monks i've seen people from practicing meditations and i've seen so beautiful scenery and i'm 100 percent sure that it was worthly to do this trekking the rep on cora it is only about three kilometers to walk but you can enjoy that you'd never have done that in your life. So next time when you are in Tibet, I would like to take you here with me to do this Drepung Kora. I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky.